Yes, there is a connection between migraine and puberty. Okay, quick refresher, a migraine is a throbbing headache. Sometimes it's associated with sensitivity to light and noise, sometimes with nausea and vomiting. Sometimes people are just so tired. About 15% of all people on earth have migraines, but when you look at it by gender, females outnumber males three to one. Why? It looks like it is estrogen, and it's not just the fact of estrogen, it's fluctuations in estrogen. It's when estrogen goes from a high level to a low level. How do we know this? Well, pregnant women tend to have fairly stable levels of estrogen, and they also have fewer migraines. Also, if you look at people who are taking estrogen, they have fewer migraines too. But in puberty, particularly female puberty, when estrogen levels are rising and falling and then rising and falling again, you start to see more and more kids develop migraines. And in fact, there's a phenomenon called menstrual migraine, which is a migraine that shows up just before a period is about to begin. This is in people of all ages. And it's because just before a period, estrogen levels drop.